I stalled long enough. <laughs> Rural digital education go. is a new frontier for students and parents alike. Jordan standing by to learn uh, how you can make the most of online resources available to young learners. That's right. You know, if, if we, ha we have difficulties sometimes with technology, and I'm sure parents at home, they will go through that as well, especially with online learning. But this morning, we're going to bring you some help. And joining us today, we've got Carly uh, Dewarji. You are a parenting coordinator and contributor to give us some helpful tips on how parents and those teaching the youngsters out there uh, can sort of navigate through these online courses. Good morning. Thanks for being with us. Tell us what you got today. Oh. One second. Let me see. I got to get the mic and turn it on really quick. Let's see if it's. One more time. Okay. Good morning. Can you hear me now? Yes, we can hear you. Uh Excellent. Okay. So yeah, like you said, it's not always the technology piece that's even challenging. It's getting our kids to be sitting there all day and getting these new routines going. So my first piece of advice for parents is get a routine and stick with it. So it's very tempting to just kind of throw caution to the wind and not keep these routines that we do when our kids are going to school, but we need to stick with them. So my first solution for that to start the day off right Teeth brushing, we just started using this in my house. It's called Bright Brush. Oh. So it is a toothbrush with integrated gameplay. So instead of nagging your kids to brush their teeth, they're actually playing a game while they brush that encourages them to use proper brushing technique and brush for the right amount of time. So they're playing games like Rockstar Jam, having a good time, and it's a win-win for us as parents because they're getting their teeth brushed for the day. <laughs> right, they might look forward to getting their, to doing that because they get to, to do it. How fun, all right, what you got next? I, yeah, okay, so back to school shopping. I know it feels like we can just stay in our jammies and not have to worry about that this year. But again, it's really important for our mental health. Get up, start your day. We don't need maybe some of the fancier clothes that we would buy for back to school. Keep it comfortable. Mm -hmm. So this is a parent-owned brand from Chicago. It's called Macache, and they have really comfy, cozy T-shirts and joggers and sweatshirts with inspiring phrases or sports that your kids love or inspiring characters right on the front. So keep it comfortable and celebrate some of those things your kids love with their clothing. All right. All right, we're sitting in front of a screen all day. I don't know about you, but my eyes start to kill me. Imagine those little guys. This is really something important that we need to think about as parents. Blue light blocking glasses, very important for their eye health. So Felix Gray is the pioneer in blue light blocking glasses. They block more blue light than any other glasses on the market. And of course, my kids love fun colors, on trend styles. We know that's very important to kids, but as parents, we know that our child's eye health Will be taken care of and they have a discount going for back to school right now for 15 percent off all right what's the what's that brand again carly for the glasses this is this is felix gray felix gray now all three items that yep. you've uh, just mentioned with us again the, the tooth brushing uh, where you can play the game that t-shirt where can folks get uh, more information on it if they're interested in maybe adding this to uh you know maybe a gift or getting this for their little one Yes, yeah, so you can head to my website. It's hello, capital M, dot com. You can also find me on Instagram. I'm a former teacher, and I'm sharing tons of tips to help parents try to navigate this new world of teaching from home. It really is a, a tough one, but we appreciate you taking your time. And again, you'll be coming back in the next hour and giving us some items, products that we can do that might be a little bit more hands-on. If the hands are moving, the kids are talking, right? So. We'll, Absolutely. We'll share more about that coming up in the next hour. Plus, we'll have more information on these products on our website. Tina, back to you. All right.